It's always uh, important to approach uh, a role, doesn't matter the gender. Of course, there is some uh, specific details, for example, the way how you walk, to perform this on stage, but vocally as well, for example, the way to express the anger, the way to express uh, freedom, anxiety, fear. <laughs> Think historically, it, it was not like the first time that men were dressing like women. So we have this in the uh, Greek theater, we have this uh, also in Shakespeare. During this culture, the people who uh, were in the theater, uh, the audience, they were kind of get used with uh, men dressing like women and playing all those characters. This repertory is something very special. And part of this is also discovered all those pieces that never been recorded for so long. So that's amazing opportunity. <laughs> Before talk about the role of Yanis, which was really important, it's also important to mention someone who gave us this idea, which was Max Emanuel Tzensik, an amazing contertenor. He gave us the idea of Roma Travestita. Uh, he was the one, when we met some years ago, he told me, like, you are the one able to sing this repertory, so that's for you. So it was, was really nice to discover and also to see the development of uh, the character and the development of the music and how the composer keep working and giving different uh, approaching and different perspective uh, during those periods. Sometimes this, the same register with uh, happiness or sadness or anger. So uh, that was the, the, the listen can expect and we'll discover new things uh, when the people will listen Roma Travestita. Mm -hmm.